It was 3.30 in the morning on the 1st of April 2011. April Fool's Day. I was in bed when there was a huge bang, like a lorry or a bus had crashed into the house. The bed was shaking from side to side and my head was lolling about on the pillow. This lasted about five seconds. Then I heard a noise as a couple of bottles fell from my wife's dressing table onto the floor. After a second earthquake on May the 27th, the hydraulic fracturing for shale gas taking place at Prees Hall, four miles away, was suspended. On November the 3rd, 2011, it was confirmed that fracking was probably the cause of the earthquakes. The British Geological Society is reported as saying, any process that injects pressurised water into rocks at depth will cause the rock to fracture and possibly produce earthquakes. Typically, the earthquakes are too small to be felt. However, there are a number of examples of larger earthquakes occurring. I wasn't the only one who felt it. Some people reported pictures on their walls shaking. Others rang the police. We're calling for a moratorium into hydraulic fracturing, at least until a detailed environmental impact assessment has been carried out into the practice.